Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Erica. We are Hitchcock Madrona. Today I am recreating some runway looks. Let's get right into it. This is a runway look from Calvin Klein, designed by Rafe Simmons, I think that's his name. So this is the look I'm working, starting with. And I knew I had some pieces in my closet, such as this cut wedding dress that I bought at, the skirt is a cut wedding dress that I bought at a costume store. There I am. And I paired it with a sweater from H&M and a mannish jacket also from H&M. I'm wearing some gloves and there's the side by side. So I thought this, I picked this because I thought it was kind of funny. This man bride sweater concept. Um, I thought it was goofy, but and I like how the look came together. I'm just wearing a tomboy chain, some delicate necklaces, oh, my Lululemon under there, and an awkward dance. So that is your first look for you. Looking like a try-hard model. The back is kind of monstrous. So pick it all up and go in the house. Okay, Gucci. You know I have to do some Gucci look. Shoot, I forgot my serial killer glasses with this. Um, so I am wearing an H&M dress with some Ann Taylor pants under there and this Theory blazer, a Ralph Lauren belt and some vintage beads we got in India. I have one, a necklace just like this in the store for sale. And I thought it was a neat layered look. I've never thought about wearing pants, a dress, a blazer, and a belt, but this was actually one of the most comfortable looks. And I fell over here. Wearing my Gucci shoes, just cause they were there. And I like the pink with that kind of rust color. So coming up is the craziest look. Such a weird, weird look. This is one of the skirts that I got in Bangkok, one of the ball skirts, and I paired that with a all lace top that I got on our isolation trip. Under that is a Nike t-shirt. I wanted this lace athletic kind of vibe. My a little scarf, bandana, and a Yankees hat. Kind of pulled the look together. This ball bag I got at the Tacoma Discount World, which is this weird store I went to with Dustin Hunter. Um, also wearing the Gucci shoes. I like the proportions of this outfit. I like the idea of wearing a ball skirt and a baseball cap. Otherwise, this is a little, say bizarre, a little weird, but I thought it was fun. Oh, looking for the pocket. Where's the pocket? There's no pocket. And again, can't find a pocket. Drees. This is a look from Drees. I am wearing an Ann Taylor skirt, a Banana Republic blouse, some black socks, my Etro shoes I got in Las Vegas, a big tangled pearl necklace, a tomboy, my cuff, my heart. Um, this couldn't, couldn't handle the socks. Could not handle the socks. I felt like they made me look like an elephant. So I took those off and as you can see, it's much, much better. She is a lady, so she has a Chanel bag. I like the colors of this. I like the patterns together. I would wear this. The next one is Burberry. And when I saw this look, I was like, I got this. Look at how I nailed it right here. So I'm wearing a ball skirt I got in Boise from Macy's. The tool layer is an H&M, a little H&M layer that I put over it. 
the Betty Boop sweater I got at an antique mall somewhere with Dustin. The jacket is Burberry also. And the boots are Steve Madden. I got those for Christmas. But I just nipped in the waist of the Betty Boop shirt. Look, her legs go all the way around. Love that. Layered it over the skirt. Really comfortable fall type look. Now we're going to Balenciaga. There was a million Balenciaga looks I wanted to do, um, but this one I loved because I knew I had this big oversized sweater from H&M. This vintage skirt I got at Goodwill. My Chanel bag, and then some Steve Madden boots that are, I believe, Balenciaga ripoffs. So... This is a neat, you know, take this proportion. I think it works. The big sweater with the skirt, very comfortable. Fun way to wear, an unfussy way to wear a skirt. And yeah, I, lo I love this outfit. Probably a total of less than $200 minus a bag. R13. R13 is taking some Levi's and charging hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So this is kind of a tricky way to wear jeans, I will admit. They are unbuttoned, folded over. I'm kind of concerned because I feel like it's bunching. Um, not the easiest, most flattering way to wear jeans, but it's a neat concept. My Ralph Lauren belt, uh, this notorious B.I.G. sweatshirt I got at Crossroads, an H&M bandana, and some fry cowboy boots. I loved the kind of swagger of this outfit. It's um, menswear, kind of bunches up at the booty. Love a saggy booty. And yeah. I, li I love that short, big Levi. Alice and Olivia. I knew I had this long leopard coat and I wanted to show you guys this Gucci ripoff skirt I got in a market in Thailand. I paired it with my Hitchcock Madrona Champion sweatshirt and some red Manolos. This skirt is so difficult to wear. I feel like it's going to disintegrate on my body. Um, it's slightly too small, but it works if you're wearing a coat. Um, don't sit down. No. Yeah, I wanted to show you guys the skirt. There's the fabric on my champion sweatshirt. All of them are unique. And that's it. I hope you guys like my recreated runway looks. Send me some pictures so I can recreate them. Thanks. Bye.